put a nice scar on his side, this one yeah. closest to us. The stripes don't quite match up. I need the one in front there. Mm -hmm. Put your camera again. Anyone still with um, Maquela around Tallies? Camp. So these are probably both her calves? Not necessarily. I just come to the Kigiria, uh, the bro bush breakfast site. Kim, where are you on the Uh, Bandana bush breakfast site. He's very lucky. Hear the impala snorting in the distance. I've seen the video of it happening. So we'll see if this is an adult female, she might try to be mating with him. If it's the young female, then uh, she's run away from it. It's the most visible part of her body. The fact that she was roaring as well, more interested in maintaining her territory and possibly looking for. So the male is one of four males that are dominant in the area. All four of them are a coalition, they all work together. Uh, at least one of his brothers further behind with him. He's just uh, trying to eat Ocker's guests. <laughs> Standing there right next to the vehicle, he's watching the female right in front of us, basically. I'm sure it's not very nice for her to come into Eastress every two weeks of her life and have to mate, and it also, puts the pride at risk and the reason that we have these males they, they can bend down quite well so they, they they generally have enough food but in the winter time a lot of the trees lose their leaves uh, so then they'd have to concentrate to uh, closer towards yeah. the river lines where it stays green Do all year round
body. Confirmed it was him and, and so on. And left him. Then he came back to life? Looks like it. Obviously it wasn't him that they found. <laughs> well, he found out there was another photo opportunity. Yeah. Is he injured? No. Now there's this um, three main types of zebra throughout Africa. These are the plain zebra. They're found everywhere in Africa. You get the grevy zebra, which is more horse-like, which is found in East Africa, yeah, it's only the Kenya. Second mainly. one I've seen. Really? Yeah. It's pretty big for an otter. Look at that power, just dragging it like that. Wow. Drag it further into the bush. No, buffalo seldom drink at the same water hole. Really? Every day. They have to move all the time. There's so many of them in a herd that they, if they stay in one area, they'll overgraze the area. They're not like cattle, they won't do that. They just 